All new right now at 10. Do you want to touch you again so you can touch your butt? And I said no. And then he clicked. Because they think they're vampires. Tonight we hear from a so-called vampire and his victim about the strange events that went on at this Valley home. Thanks for choosing us tonight. I'm Katie Rammel. Police just released video of one-on-one -on -one interviews with these two. ABC 15's Corey Rangel shares them with us tonight. It's a bizarre interview about what happened inside this Chandler apartment. Robert Maley told police his roommate stabbed him in the arm because he wouldn't let him suck his blood. He wants to touch you again so he can suck your blood. Uh, I said no. And then he clicked because they think they're vampires. Maley says his roommate, Aaron Homer, and his girlfriend, Amanda Williamson, were into paganism. And Maley even admitted he let Homer suck his blood in the past. I let him cut me so he can suck my blood. Okay. Just he sucked your blood? Yes. Okay, not the girl? No. When police first arrived at the apartment, Homer initially told police his girlfriend stabbed Maley in self-defense. But police got suspicious after investigators say Homer kept changing his story and after investigators found fake blood throughout the apartment. Why is there fake blood all over your floor and all over your room and fake blood on the knife that was supposedly in somebody's arm? This is a really freaky situation. I know he was bleeding. You got that right. Yeah. You're definitely right about that. Police ended up arresting Homer and his girlfriend, both accused of lying to police and trying to cover up the stabbing. Corey Rangel, ABC 15 News. This is I don't care... If you think I'm Satan reincarnated, <laughs> the fact is, you can't look at that television and say nothing happened.